Learning to fly is the dream of millions of people since long before we started to fly. Then as we see others become pilots of their own planes or rental planes, it sparks us even more. There's a reason so many people attend air shows. Even the low and the slow planes spark our interest. When we pursue the hobby of flying or the career of flying, it's going to cost money, lots of money. That's why most of us cannot afford to learn to fly. Or at least we think we can afford it until the lessons keep going, the funds dry up, or other things in life take precedence. This is where I come in. My name is Howard Forder. In my lifelong pursuit of piloting an airplane for sheer pleasure, I took the one tool I had been using for years, Flight Simulator, and used it alongside the actual lessons of flying from real flight schools. Because Microsoft's Flight Simulator is so realistic with accurate runways, actual radio frequencies, and photorealistic cockpits, we can practice for free again and again. Over 15 million pilots use Flight Simulator to practice approaches and hone their skills. Here in this course, I'll step you through lessons, demonstrate the skills, share videos of every flight skill for you to download and compare to your progress. You will be learning all the skills and practicing each one as you learn it. For some, learning to fly correctly in Flight Simulator is all they want to learn and keep using it to fly a variety of planes to countless destinations. But for others, this is the stepping stone to obtaining your pilot's license. Real lessons at a local airport flight school coupled with practicing in flight simulator, as I did. There are seven major lesson areas in this beginner course, just as there are in a flight school pilot program. Some of the things you will learn and practice are taxiing around the airport, handling your airplane before you take to the sky, correct takeoff procedures, speeds, checks, level off procedures, straight and level flight, standard rate turns, map minding, climbing and descending correctly, approach to airspaces, entry and exit, and of course the circuit, how to enter and land. All through this radio procedures, talking with control towers. We'll also taxi to the apron and correct shutdown checklists. There, there are materials for you to download, such as the area flight map, the Cessna 172 checklist, which I have simplified for flight simulator in this course, a cockpit poster to study, and assignments that need to be submitted. When you finish this course, you'll be able to confidently handle an airplane from startup taxi, takeoff, flight maneuvers, return to airport, and land correctly without crashing. All the while listening to and responding to air traffic controllers. This same program has been tested in real airport schools where my job was to prepare new pilots first in the simulator before they stepped into real airplanes. You too can start with this beginner course. Learn the essentials needed no matter what size of airplane you wish to eventually fly. But I do have to mention, you will need to acquire a flight stick or a flight yoke. Real pilots don't fly with a mouse or a keyboard. The ideal setup for this course is an inexpensive flight yoke, rudder pedals, and Flight Simulator 2004 or Flight Simulator X from Microsoft. But we can talk about sources and cost in the course. I just don't want you to be surprised to hear this after you buy the course. Enroll now in this beginner learn to fly course and start learning today. This can be fun, exhilarating, inexpensive and thrilling. Skills and thrills for a lifetime. See you inside.